This is salt fish. However, in America, you call it codfish. It's salted oh. codfish. And we prepare this by um, taking off that, oops, I don't know what. <laughs> we take off, we take it out of the pod and we clean it, wash it thoroughly. And then we go ahead and we uh, fry it with the saltfish here. We boil it then fry it. And this is the finished product here. And it is prepared with breadfruit, whether it's fried or roasted, plantains, dumplings. And these are what we call dumplings, fried dumplings right here. And over here we have boiled dumpling and yellow yams. That looks so good. Is it better than tilapia? I've never tried that one before. Tilapia is disgusting to eat. All right. Um, go ahead, Ezra, and you may continue. It's Christmas time in Jamaica. It is fast approaching Christmas, ain't it? Let me tell you how Jamaicans deal with Christmas. Jamaicans prepare many dishes during Christmas and get together with families and friends, just like Americans do, do during Thanksgiving. We prepare jerk, pork, and chicken, curry goat, and chicken stew, stew peas, soup, brown stew, oxtail, fried fish, steamed fish with some okra, and cracker, just to name a few. Christmas is not the same without our unique Christmas cake and our sorrel drink. We play games like cards, dominoes, ludi, and talk and have a merry time. Try not to be scared while on the streets during the Christmas season, as the junkuno may just sneak up and scare you. These are often persons dressed in costumes such as cow head, horse head, belly woman, king and queen, etc. All right, so on the screen, what you're actually seeing is uh, um, the Jankuno outfits. And the, they do masquerades and you'll be just there shopping or even in a restaurant and you just see one of them sneak up on you. Most of the time, um, I personally, I get scared. I do not like to see them <laughs> because they're very scary. Imagine you sitting there or having something to eat or you're shopping and then you just see something comes up with this head. <laughs> I usually run the cow head or they have a house and then you'll see the horns. If you look carefully, you see the horns here. And I mean, they literally wear this for the entire day. That literally looks so strange. Why All right, face now, like as he mentioned earlier, these are some of the dishes prepared. So we have the jerk chicken, we have the jerk pork for the pork lovers. Uh, we have curry chicken with white rice, which is mostly what we eat our curries with, but there are persons who have it with um, rice and peas, as you call it, rice and beans. Curry goat. All right, now we have our brown stale ox, our brown stew ox tail and our steamed fish and okra with cabbage. But, um, Crackers. Hey, will you cook these to us sometimes? Yeah, I'll try. Good. <laughs> I'll try. Cookies. All well. right, and oh. these now are our traditional. We always have this during Christmas. So this is called the fruit cake, and it's usually made with um, Jamaican white rum. So what we do, we soak our raisins thoroughly, probably soaking for a year from September. So you know, by the time it gets to Christmas, that is well marinated. Oh, and we go ahead and we bake that and we also have it with some refreshing i'm sorry this should be the sorrel drink and it's a fruit again our plant which we actually just soak it in the water and we boil that 
we put some purses put a little rum in it for the children we would not but for the adults we would and then we let that chill and we have that with our slice of cake oh, okay. <laughs> all right the question that we have now is what do you in america do during the christmas season seeing that in jamaica based on the presentation they actually cook a lot of food and it's almost like your thanksgiving and they play games what is it that is done here in america you want to go ahead and share that information yes. with yes. the students back in jamaica all right zoe i see your hand All right, thank you. Mrs. Ashby, were you able to hear? Not so clearly. We have, we gather with our families and make and cook food and we have something called a Christmas tree and we hang ornaments on it, on our Christmas tree. And okay, I heard that. Yeah. And we hang stockings over a, our mantles and children, most children believe that Santa Claus is going to come and put presents under the Christmas tree and in little presents in their stockings. All right, thank you. Uh, go ahead, Ashton, and you'll be the final one we take. Is Christmas the same there as it is here? All right, so that's a question back home there in Jamaica. Is Christmas the same here as it is there? It's basically the really. same. Not really, though. Not kinda. really. Kinda. Not really, though. Come yet. No, no. We have different types of food really? and traditions. All right. However, do you have the Christmas tree as well? Do you go ahead and put ornaments on those? And yes. Put yes, please. Oh, okay. <laughs> Um, some families do, and some families don't. Some families do, some families don't. All right. Also, what about um, believing that Santa Claus is going to go ahead and put Christmas beneath their trees? No. 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 All right. Uh, in terms of the weather condition, is it cold or does it snow in Jamaica? Miss, it's very cold. It's cold. It's cold. It's cold. It's cold. Yeah, but it has a lot of snow. It's very windy. It's very, very, nice. very windy. Very cold. Very cold. All right, so it gets cold at really times cold. and it's windy based on where you are located. All right. Thank you. Joanna, it's your time. Okay, Miss. Easter time. During during Easter, we don't do egg hunting. We are busy eating Easter bun and cheese or fish. 
During the Easter, most Christian household consu consume mostly fish and less red meat. Almond with our with our traditional bun and cheese. I heard that egg hunting is common in America during the Easter. Is that so? What else is done during the Easter? Are there any traditional food associated with Easter? All right, Ms. McClendon, we'll take the questions from your class on this one. My family eats it because half of them are Jamaican and half of them is English. What do they eat? What is common for Easter? Amber, can you tell them what's it's common for Easter here? Chocolate. Chocolate, what else? A lot of times we'll have sunrise service, right? Candy. Easter egg hunt. Period. A lot of times we'll have like ham or something. Um, guys, go ahead. Go up there and tell them. Or say loud. For fun, we got eggs. And boiled eggs. Jordan. Oh, Jordan. 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 And yeah, lots of want coconut. All right, so that's coconut cakes and a lot of chocolate sweets, right? All right, sounds good. Um, so we see a difference here as it relates to both culture. One culture has bun and cheese, and the other has eggs and chocolates and coconut cake. That's going to be an interesting one because we also have coconut cakes and let's, we're going to see whether it's the same or it's different. We will be doing that one. All right, so here we go. We have some other unique foods that is associated with Jamaica. This pink one here, pink and white, this is called greater cake. And this is made from coconuts. So it's coconut um, with sugar as well. We have gizada here. So this has a little flour in it along with coconut again and sugar with cinnamon. And you can add your own little flavor to it as well. Down here we have the coconut drops. It's made with coconut. However, this time it's not grated. It is diced. So we dice the coconut. We use sugar again. It's not baked, um, however, it is just set there. It hardens over time. And we have our peanut cake here. The peanut cake, this one now is made with peanuts, again, sugar, and it's very nice. If you're a peanut lover, you would like this, and you can use different types of peanuts, whether it's almond, cashew, or regular nuts. Pardon? What? Peanut butter. Peanut butter. Peanut butter. I've never tried that one. <laughs> All right. Um, now we have something called the blue draws, but the correct term is actually dukunu. Now, Mrs. Ashmi, do you care to share how this one is made? Well, for the for the dukunu. I know that is made with cornmeal and it is put to bake in banana leaves. Yes, and vanilla goes with it. Yes, you put the spices in it, your nutmeg, 
and and all the different spices cinnamon the same flour and, and sugar it. and salt too right and you put it to bake in the banana leaf so you tie it so when it is baked and you take off the banana leaf then it has that nice little shape on it miss i never try any of jamaican culture food really since i never tasted i never tried this you know before Excuse me, Miss. I eat I never um, all of those all the time the from my neighbor. Okay, thank you. All right, and to the I top left, to the top left here. This is a slice of our wonderful Christmas cake, and down here is our patties. Now, I must say the patties vary. You have beef, you have cheese, you have chicken, you have jerk chicken. You have kalaloo, that's greens if you're a vegetarian, and you have the shrimp, and I'm not sure if I'm missing any, but they try to have a variety based on based on your meat preference. I love fruit. I was about how you just kind of like split the peanut butter. Oh, you're a peanut butter lover. Oh, heck yeah. All right. Now this is the interactive session. I am going to ask Adeline, Adeline, what picture, what food is that? How do you say that one? What's that, what's that food? It's a banana. Uh-uh, it's similar to a banana, but it's not a banana. It starts with a P. It's a A patty. You say banana. Even for, don't you have plantains? Plantains. Right. So go ahead. Adeline, what's this? Huh? Plantain. Okay. Mrs. Hashmi, do you care to share this with one of your students and have them tell what this is in Jamaica? All right. Who would like to try? Janine, go ahead. Name it. Name it. Name Yes, Janine, could you tell them what that food is? This is um, it's a plantain mix. We Jamaicans usually fry plantain with other food. With other foods, and we normally boil it, and it tastes very good. And, it's and, what, and what other names do we call it? Miss, could I say it? Go, Sharon. Platin. <laughs> Platin. <laughs> All right. Okay. Miss Plantin. Sometimes say Platin. Okay. Miss Plantin. All right. So um, when we're using or English or standard Jamaican English, we say plantain. However, when we're using our dialect, it's plantain. Plantain. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be. It's it's really tricky. All right. Now sometimes the words are very different. Let's try this one. These this we have a group of what? Children. Children. Why do we pitney, call this Pitney, 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 or Pitney, However, when we're using our standard Jamaican English, it's children or kids. Yes, but for a dialect, it's Pitney. All right, let's try this one. What is all right so let's do this again what's this one called in jamaica so using Using our Creole, it is called tomatis. What, what is it called? Tomatis. Tomatis. All right. All right. So this one is a little bit different. So we're moving it from one word to a sentence. All right. Hold on. Back home in Jamaica. Hold on. We're going to start here in America first. Uh, all right. Go ahead, Timothy. Can you read the sentence here? No, in the black and white. The boys are sitting on a chair. Can you project a bit or come closer? 
The boys are sitting on a chair. The boys are sitting on a chair. All right. Thank you, Mrs. Ashby. Can I have one of the other students um, say this sentence using our Jamaican dialect? Yes, Mr. Ken, go ahead and, and shoot the name. Why are you doing in the chair? The boy is the the boy is 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 the the boy the boy is the boy the boy is the the boy is the boy the boy is the boy the boy is the is the boy the boy is the boy the 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 so it's like totally different. The words are I totally different. So, <laughs> so the boy them a sit down on the chair. All right, Tristan, go ahead. Read this one. The boy threw away the ball. How do we say this in Jamaica? The boy 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 threw away the ball, or how else could we rephrase it? The boy, boy threw the ball. The boy threw away 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 the ball. All right, I love you, Bryson. Let's go. Can you read this one, please? Project. Open your eyes. Open your eyes. All right, let's listen to this one. How do, how would you say this now using the dialect in Jamaica? Open your eyes. Open your eyes. All right, so we don't say I, we say yai. So it's not I, it's yai. Open your eyes. Yeah. Oh, Alright, um, at this point, we are, I believe we're at the end, yes, 